grandest event in world football. And a grand welcome to you as you join us for our live coverage of what we hope will be a game that sets it off in style. Just have a look at it, feel it. This really is the best of the beautiful game in motion at fever pitch, and the players are ready. Certainly, this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. So, a strong start, essential for both teams here as they look to head towards the knockout stage. Well, Peter, I can tell you that both managers will have stressed the need for a very strong start here. Both... Oh, shooting chance! Kane with a shot! Goal! Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal, too, is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge, and long may that continue. Kane did well there, he was on to it in a trice. That's just great play, Peter. A textbook example for any wannabe footballers out there on positioning and movement. England ahead, one goal to the good. Sterling steaming forward. Oh, some tackle that. Sterling really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Sancho, with a delicate ball. That's gone a long way up and away. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them... Hits one! Oh, that was extravagant by any standard. Asmoon certainly showed brilliant imagination there to take on such a high tower of skill. Asmoon. Asmoon! He's got away with one there. Well, it was just some wayward passing that let the opposition in then, and I have to say, a very lucky escape. You lose it there, you expect to be punished. Stones drives it forward. Walker. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Forward it goes. There has been just the early goal here, and the score is 1 0. Now, can he finish? And that's been one straight, but he's gone for it. Business. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, I think this is a case of anything you can do, we can do too. I mean, they're matching each other like for like here. It's always going to be the keepers. Made into space out wide. Going through. Maguire plays it forward. Now it's Kane. He's played it through. It's one! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Look, when we talk about decision-making, there's a great example, strong and decisive. Phillips. Jordan Henderson. Look at the defender bombing forward. Carries 
far too far and out of play. Managed to get it away. Chance! Tries to get it clear. Has moon. It's being played forward. Oh, good interception. Okay. And it's played forward. Good ball. And it's Sterling. Jordan Henderson. That's a good ball to find him. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. As he picked him out, face to face with the shoots! Oh, that's a fine save! The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Time, what it has been, an even contest as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. The midway point of the game. Oh, what a half of football! It's 1 1, but it could easily be 3 3 or, or more. Breakneck speed brilliance. It's a really interesting game, and they head in at half time at 1 1. So we're already into the second period. Changes made by neither side, from what we understand. Hoists it forward. Looks to clip it forward. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Sancho showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. As Moon, as Moon crosses, goalkeeper's ball. Tries to get it forward quickly. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Real chance! Some players are just capable of grabbing a game by the scuff of the neck, and his immense talent may just have done exactly that and injected the belief that they can retain their lead this time round. A oh, beautifully dispatched, there was no reaching that. Well, for me, you can't fault the keeper. Though. The effort went in at the widest possible point off the upright, nothing he can do. England themselves into the lead. We sit forward. Shaw, run down the left wing. Sterling. Everything they would have spoken about in that dressing room during the break has a greater chance of happening thanks to the early goal. It's the perfect platform now to go on and try to win it. Now the counter. Great run on the overlap here. This is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Towering header! And in it goes! And there's the goal they've been looking for. 
just so calm under pressure. Jordan Henderson really showed good strength there. Held his man off, didn't let himself get bullied, and got his effort away. Maintained control. That got changes here from both sides, in fact. But amongst the goals here, and now he takes his lead. But he can only give the all. He's delivered in that regard, and I think the manager is probably just spotted now a little tired and squeaky. You know, if that's the case, then you know, he's doing the right thing. England threw up into a position of real strength. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. He's had a shot! He can count on that! Oh, that was no routine save! Sterling is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. The changes then in quick succession. Kane being applauded off here, having made a sizable contribution. I think he's put in a good shift, and, and their fans appreciate that. I think he can feel pretty happy with the, the contribution he's made. Henderson. A real chance to break. Field, changing the point of attack. Shapes to shoot! They just took too long getting forward. Oh, Peter, the best counter attacks are, are pacey and incisive, we know that, and that one never really got going. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Jordan Henderson. A buccaneering run from the defender. Should have put that one away. Calvert Lewin just got a little carried away with himself there. He knew he could have clinched it. Stops it away. to safety. Shaw does have an assist to his name. It's a good run down the left-hand side. A heavy challenge. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Shaw, he's got away, Shaw delivers, cut out in the nick of time. Well, that's where he wants it, Maguire gets into the right position to intercept. Shaw. Maguire goes back to base. It upfield. Put offside that time. Quick glance at goal. And the weighted pass. Walker goes looking. It towards the front and it's the goalkeeper to play. It's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Foden. Oh, well played. He has a pop. Goes for goal. And that may well be that. That is that. Pretty much the ideal start. A win on the first day and a platform on which to build. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? 
Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive result isn't achieved in your opening group match. Instead, they can take great confidence now from a very good victory and look ahead with real belief. England are really buzzing. Uh, campaign could have got off to a better start. Three points already in the bag. The repeat performance here would certainly see them take a massive stride towards the knockout stages. You sense an air of quiet confidence that they are ready to do just that. Supporters certainly winning them on in every possible way. Things look good. Has a goal! And he's there to make a great save. Altidore sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Played it short. Oh, that's meat. In it comes. Early. Jordan Henderson knocks it in gently. Up for the header! It's there! Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal too is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge, and long may that continue. What a super header, dispatched beautifully. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. England ahead, one goal to the good. Phillips. Shaw. Kyle Walker. Sterling. Wrestled off the ball. England are already ahead. The perfect start.
always when you score early, it gives you such a lift and it, it casts doubt in the minds of your opponents at the same time. And that pretty much sums up the difference in what we've seen. One team assured, the other a little unsure. Phillips. Now it's Kane. Kane! It's scored! All too easy. They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. I just thought that was going to hit the outside of the post for a moment there, but it was just close enough to catch the inside for a very good strike. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. England themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition looked completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Well, they would seem to be trying to expose the centre of that defence to, to runners. Thanks for some terrific movement. It does, and they may be hit on the break because obviously it requires numbers forward to, to stretch them out. And it's Kay. Sterling. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Played into space out wide. And helps available out wide. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. It'll be a throw in. Maguire. For a throw. Walker tries to stroke it through. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. And he's straight offside. as soon as they gave it away. In once more. Struck first time. Disappointing finish in the end. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Green. Pulisic. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Taps it out. There's the whistle for half-time. We can review the first half. 
England just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. England go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. Start of the second half. Green. Pulisic. Ball is over the line. Oh, sweet feet. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those breaking passes just to spread the play. Sterling looks to clip it forward. It's Rashford! And more, and more, and more! And surely that settles it! So here comes the substitution. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Green. Phillips. A free kick for that. Rashford. He spotted the run and played him through. He's had a shot. Oh, he couldn't get hold of it. Yeah, they got away with it, but that was a, a defensive letdown to see him march through like that. He's left his man. Stones does well there. Alert. Rashford. Battles to win it back. Kane looks to get on the end of this. Green. It's the through ball. Chance to shoot. Oh, great defending. That needed doing. Needed a better pass there. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? England put it back again. Pulisic. Sancho gets it back. He's got options out wide. And that's been well dealt with. And the counter is on. The United States have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Calvert Lewin. Pulisic. Shaw. Sancho, Rashford, decent looking ball, that's pretty clear, it is a foul, there could be trouble here, but for now the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Played forward. Just 
brushed off the ball there. Kyle Walker. Walker goes looking. Defending was strong and firm. The changes there in quick succession. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift. He's in space and looking for options. England really have been alive to interceptions and picking off any loose balls. Sancho shoots! Great football, shot and save. Grealish, a heavy challenge. Tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the flank. And time is up. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. No mistake, a perfect two wins out of two, and they appear set fair. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? England simply imposed their strength from start to finish, and this became as predictable as predicted. And so the prevalent question on everybody's mind ahead of the game here, will they make it out of the group stage? Well, the odds are very, very good on paper. A single point is all that they need, and they need no favours from anybody else. It is in their hands. The faithful has every right to expect, to believe, feeling very much effective in the pre-match atmosphere. Gladiatorial arena that is the Stadio Olimpico, for so long the symbol of Rome's grand sporting history. England lining up with a look of total focus. Eyes on the prize, which is way beyond these group stages. Well, when you consider, Peter, how hard they worked to be on the threshold of the next phase, they ought to be thoroughly focused and determined to, to wrap it up now. If their attitude and application remains as it's been through the group, then they should be fine. But if they suffer a moment's hesitation or doubt, as we've seen in the past, it could prove very costly. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Oh, the whistle's gone, what's he given? No, the referees judged that the offence took place outside the area. It's gone a long way up and away. That's been leave it clear. Rashford. It's good progress.
progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Rashford! Good stop. What an easy. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Calvert Lewin is an obvious threat from set pieces. He needs best. Great leap! Bale tries to clear. That'll be a throw. Roberts finds himself eased off the ball. Wales have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but what's their thinking? Um, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. Goes for goal! A real chance and a real let-off. Sure, look very impressive there. Well, at least until he got into a shooting position, something I'm sure he'll want to have a go at again. Plays it out to the wing. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Roberts. Maguire battles to win it back. And here's Ramsey. Just brushed off the ball there. Shaw. Looks to thread it through. And through to the goalkeeper. Still goalless. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Rice plays it forward. Jordan Henderson. He can give it a corner. Oh, shooting chance! And he couldn't get hold of it. That's been drilled forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. Rice. Forward it goes. Big towards the front then. Need to avoid defeat, and it means so much to them. Roberts plays it out to the flank. And he's looking at the referee, but the referee is shaking his head. Shaw. Sure. towards half-time, and it is still scoreless. Sancho has got himself a free kick. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. It's a loose ball. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. He gets past his... It's Bale! The captain delivers! Well, look, captains so often feel a greater responsibility to come up with something a little extra, especially approaching the break. He knew the significance in striking before him. The pressure he moves now will be very, very different. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Calvert-Lewin, Calvert-Lewin! Cleared without complication. It's good distance on it. Towards the end of the first.
first half. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But London still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. They can do some game up to now. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. And if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. The action has already resumed here. Well, it seems like the perfect situation for Fortune to be in the break. 45 minutes, shapes to shoot! No space, no problem, you just cannot stop him. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't seem on. It's really crafty business, that. Wales take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. We're looking at a very different game now. The command has been established. Roberts, header! Oh, not the best of headers. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? England are making a change now. Shaw. Maguire. Crunching tackle. Played out to the right, dashing forward at pace. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right. He couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Chip through. Knocks it away. Up for the header! Go for it! And Padu, it clear. A heavy challenge. That's pretty clear. It is a foul. So he's plotting something before playing it in. And it's sure. Has a hit! There's a goal! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. England get themselves back into contention. Well, I think they probably needed an early goal in this half just to give them the confidence and belief to push on and look for an equaliser. He's left his man. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And he has shown him a yellow card. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that piece, is he? On the balls come Luke, in he goes again! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. England really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. England are definitely going about this the right way. There's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. It just has to be done. It's a promising ball. Timely intervention. Danger averted for now. Shaw. Back they come! England are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. They've got changes here, from both sides, in fact. 
This has become one superb game of football. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Jordan Henderson. Davis drives it forward. Nicely measured pass. Hit Roberts! And somehow he managed to miss it. Well, we could be headed for a scenario in which next goal is the winner. That chance could have been it too. Sterling, out to the right. Look, plays a clever pass. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Foden clips one through. And he's straight offside. England showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Foden. Maguire. Oh, what about it? This is going right to the wire. England merit full marks for their attitude and up with... Oh, real danger here! Oh, great defending, that needed doing. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Been leave it clear. It'll be a throw in. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. And here's Kane. Loose. Delivers across. Tries to get it clear. Throw. Foden pumps it into the area. Knocks it away. Davis hoists it forward. To overtime. Jordan Henderson. And here's Sterling. Walker. Sterling. And that will be the final act. Well, they could only manage a draw, but that will do. They have made it to the next stage. Well, how will we look back on that? It's certainly doing it the hard way, Peter, but the most important thing is that the team got the job done. Getting through is all that mattered, and whatever tests came their way, they showed they were more than capable of dealing with it, an experience that can benefit them all in the longer term.
Well, hello and welcome to what is, in effect, the second half of this grand global spectacle featuring the major characters of the world game. One is the relative safety of the group stage. This is where everything now is do or die. One mistake could cost you a place in the quarterfinals. Everything suddenly and awful not more serious. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Defending of the desperate variety. He goes along. Good ball. The room. Floats one over. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Stokes. Sancho, Jordan Henderson, Phillips, Shaw, and the weighted pass, looking for space out wide. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. He gets past his man, can he find a finish now? He's gone for it! It's broken loose. <laughs> Memphis Depay plays it out to the flank. It will be a throw in. Good challenge, he just stood firm. The attempt, but not quite good enough. Blint. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. Jordan Henderson. Jerome. Phillips as well there, alert. And it's played forward. Well played, he saw that coming. The room. A real chance of it has a pop! Goal! The Netherlands! And it's the Netherlands who take the lead! The Netherlands are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. The Netherlands have made their breakthrough. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Memphis Depay gets his final warning. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. But it's Henderson. And play for a goal kick. Sterling. And here's Kane. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Forward it goes. Maguire, and it's Shaw. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Now it's Memphis Depay. It's got loose. Wijnaldum puts it back. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Oh, looks like he's been taken out there. 
Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. Sterling goes up and over. Room for a shot. Going for goal! Yes, it's there! The understanding between those two plays a big part in that, and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. England at the equaliser, and we're all square. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback, and this is thoroughly merited for me. Now they can go with better, possibly. He's made sure that that won't get through. Right, goes looking. Right, Alden. Played out to the right. into some space to roam now the breakaway Greenish out to the right Jordan Henderson it into the middle cleared without complication and the first half is done so, a very watchable game so far, action at both ends and the team's level. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, this match promised goals and it certainly hasn't let us down. It's been really, really entertaining. That's a really interesting game and they hit in at half. Big chance! Wonderful! Well, whatever was said in the dressing room at half-time has worked. And so often, it's the big-name players who respond. What a great, great goal to reclaim the advantage. Superstar. Terrific audacity, just gorgeous skill. It just came down to a battle of wills between him and the keeper, and he won it with a cracking piece of trickery. The Netherlands get themselves into the lead. Now it's Memphis to pie. The room. The Ligt. The Ligt drives it forward. It out to the wing. The referee's had a good look and given a corner. Lint plays it short. Shaw plays it forward. Greenish. Fine album. It's Memphis to pass. A chance! He's been bundled over. That is a foul. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Stones tries to get it forward quickly. Henderson battles to win it back. Found his man, could move up a gear here, going through, Kane. The referee has given a corner. And he checks on the touchline, a change, shoots! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Mr. Pye. Memphis to Pye. Gets the pillar of his man. Great lead! Oh, nearly. Nearly is nothing. A more than decent attempt, Peter. The changes then in quick succession. Across the field it goes. England can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. It's the road. Takes it over to the other flank. 
Wijnaldum. Big chance to get at them. Shaw. And here's Kane. Daron gets it back. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Great challenge, time to perfection. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? England are definitely going about this the right way. Well, I hope it's just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Well, the referee's pulled play back and has booked him for the original offence. Henderson. Grealish! A real chance and a real let-off. They're probably getting frustrated by the lack of chances, I suppose. England making consecutive changes here. Kane amongst the goals and he's being taken off now. Yeah, he'll get a good ovation for his contribution. I'm not so sure why he's leaving us, though. There's no obvious sign of, of injury or fatigue. Header! He's gone a long way off and away. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Just brushed off the ball there. Stones is the guilty party there. <laughs> the Netherlands are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Must need it to be better than that. He knows it. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. De Ligt gets into the right position to intercept. And it's Rashford. Calvert-Lewin. If the time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Fired in. It's one! Oh, it's the wrong outcome. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. We had a lot of people worried there. Hoist it forward. Maguire. Rashford. Tries to dink it in. And he's there to cut it out. Four extra minutes added on. Ball through needs to be good here. Well, it's Memphis to punt. Whistle's gone and they've got themselves a free kick. He's pulled off a fine save. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes. Goalkeeping at its very best. Header! No, he didn't quite meet it right. Very well to intervene. That's it. They are out. England eliminated in round one. It is so far.